Praise the Lord. The 40th anniversary celebration of the liberation mandate comes up between 2nd and 9th of May 2021. <laughs> Hallelujah. Please know that this is not a ceremony, but a prophetic feast. Every winner is expected to prepare their heart to meet with the God of liberation in this one week long prophetic feast, according to Isaiah 25, verses 6 to 8. Be reminded to rush in the testimonies of God of liberation in your life to the email on the screen. Number two, praise the Lord. The first special miracle service of last Sunday was a huge success. <laughs> Hallelujah. With diverse instant healing testimonies, to God be all the glory. Number three, good news. The second edition of the Wolfby Specialized Three-Day Certificate Course for the year 2021 shall feature securing miracle jobs for those believing God for miracle jobs. The date is Tuesday 2nd to Thursday 4th, March 2021. Every participant should expect word encounters that will provoke divine intervention resulting in diverse testimonies. Times will be 7.45 a.m. to 4 p.m. daily. Note that this holds only in Canaan land and forms are available at the Wobby Complex. Number four, praise the Lord. The Youth Alive Fellowship holds a youth advance meeting tomorrow, Thursday, 25th, and Friday, 26th, February, 2021. You can make it louder for Jesus. These will take place at designated centers across Lagos and Otter. Time is 5 to 7 p.m. Number five, Covenant Hour of Prayer continues tomorrow, Thursday to Saturday. Time is 5.30 to 6.30 a.m. Number six, good news. The online sale of admission forms to our Faith Academy Network of Schools closes this Friday, 26 February, 2021. To purchase form, please visit Education Commission's official website listed on the screen. Number seven, praise the Lord. Four intending couples were this weekend. <laughs> Hallelujah. We are admonished to stand in the gap for them in prayers and share in their joy. Time is 11 a.m. Number eight, Winner Satellite Fellowship. Our House to House Fellowship holds this Saturday at our WSF centers across Lagos and Otter. Time is 5 to 6 p.m. Lastly, number nine, praise the Lord. Next Sunday at Faith Tabernacle, 28 February 2021, shall be our covenant day of marital breakthroughs. <laughs> Hallelujah. It shall also double as a special end of the month Thanksgiving, children, and marriage dedication service. Come expecting diverse turnaround encounters by the world and the mystery of Thanksgiving. Times remain 6 a.m., 7.55 a.m., 9.50 a.m., and 11.45 a.m. Jesus is Lord. In this service, it is testimony time. Please listen to the following documented testimonies, and your own shall be in the next. Number one, healed via encounter from book. <laughs> Hallelujah. Recently, my health came under a severe challenge. What started as a mere headache grew so bad that I had pains in my chest, back, and stomach. The more medicines I took, the worse the situation became. At a point, I could not breathe well. However, despite the discomfort, I struggled to engage in the just concluded spiritual week of emphasis, believing God for my healing. Thereafter, I decided to read the book, Exploits of Faith, authored by Bishop David Oyedepo. Meanwhile, I had read the book before, but this time I approached it with a better understanding, believing there must be a way out. With the help of the Holy Spirit, I encountered light in page 95. And I understood, you can make it bigger for Jesus. <laughs> Hallelujah. And I understood why all the past efforts were not effective. Then Matthew 8, 17 became real to me. And I knew that sickness is an illegal occupant in my body. My faith came alive. 
and that settled it as I was miraculously healed. I return all the glory to God. And the testifier is Olayinka Ashiru. Shall we put our hands together for Jesus? Number two, three years career stagnation terminated. Amen. I have believed God for career breakthrough for years, but the more I waited, the more difficult things became. You are turning for me. Then I held onto Papa's word that every stagnated career is opening up for the better. Reminding us that God is not a user of men, but a rewarder. I remember some testimonies of others who stopped praying for themselves, but engaged in kingdom advancement prayers and winning souls. I did exactly so. I increased my service to God by joining two service groups. Winning souls for God everywhere I found myself, mostly when searching for jobs. Suddenly, I felt this inexplainable joy from inside. I got a call from a former boss begging me to work with them again. Reluctantly, I accepted the offer. And to my amazement, the offer came with a very beautiful accommodation. <laughs> Hallelujah. Not only that, better salary among others. I have come to return all the glory to the almighty God. And the testifier is Sarah UO. Let's put our hands together in appreciation to God. Next, when we rise again this evening, we shall be praying, saying, Father, in the name of Jesus, we decree the release of fresh and life-transforming word in all our services all through the year. Can our amen be stronger tonight? Psalm 23 and verse 2, He maketh me to lie down in green pastures, he laid me beside the still waters. Please, let's rise together tonight. Lift up our voices, saying, Father, in the name of Jesus, we decree the release of life transforming a fresh word in all our services all through the year. Lift up your voice, everyone, tonight uh, as we engage our hearts and our faith uh, in this prayer. Our Father and our God, in the name of Jesus, we decree the release of fresh word. We decree the release uh, of life transforming word uh, in all our services all through this year. In the name of Jesus Christ, lift up your voice uh, and show your praying tonight. Uh, we are making a demand on the altar of prayer. Our Father and our God, uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, we decree tonight uh, the release of fresh word. We decree tonight the release uh, of life transforming word in all of our services uh, all through this year. Let it be, Lord. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, engage some more tonight. Uh, we are praying the will of our Heavenly Father tonight. Therefore, lift up your voice. Uh, make a demand tonight with faith uh, in your heart and confidence in your God, our Father. In the name above every other name, the name of Jesus Christ, uh, we decree tonight the release uh, of fresh and life-transforming word uh, in all of our services uh, all through this year in the name of jesus christ we are asking tonight for the rain of your power packed word every time we gather in all our sunday services all our midweek services covenant our prayer sessions our home cell fellowship every time your people gather